In this tutorial, we will be covering using the table and erect buckies. To interact with the table, in the equipment menu, we can access table and bucky, or we can click on the table, or numerical key three will bring up the same menu. Here on the menu, we have the foot pedals. So we have an up and down, and then we have the foot switch release. By engaging with the foot switch release, we then have access to movement of the table, longitudinally, and then transverse movement. We also get access to the, to the bucky tray which can be moved longitudinally underneath the table. You can see that if you are depressing the left mouse button and holding it down and then it locked that bucky into position. So I'll do that again. Left mouse button down, it moves all the way to the end. I have released, now left mouse button down, holding it and it locks into place. To interact with the table detector, again we come to our receptor on the drop down menu for the table or we can actually select it by the left mouse button click. To deselect anything, you left mouse somewhere that's not on the piece of equipment or we have our shortcut key numerical key 4 will allow access to that table receptor. We access this purely to place the side marker. We select the marker we want. We drag it to the anticipated location we wish to have on our final image. Once the side marker is placed, we can then manipulate it. This is what is required if we're doing upper limb activity so you would you would need to alter the placement and orientation of our side markers when positioning for example a hand. We also have our PA markers should we wish to place them depending on the projection we are doing. When wishing to interact with our erect bucky under equipment we will see the erect bucky where we're allowed access to our stand controls. This access can also be gained by touching the front of our bucky or numerical key value 5. This then allows us to interact with the vertical movement of this bucky. If we wish to place a side marker, again we can find our erect receptor under the equipment menu. We can actually click on the receptor as we see it or numerical keypad number six. And here, like we did with our table receptor, we can place our side markers as we see fit. The placement of our side marker is equivalent to placing it on our cross crosshair here. So this L marker we would expect to transpose in this region. And that concludes this tutorial.